Las Vegas Coin Company brings decades of experience specializing in high-end coins and collectibles. They have unique pieces you won't find anywhere else, and they invite you to find the value in your hidden treasures. Yes, even Coke bottles like this. <laughs> Heads up uh, right now because precious metals actually are hitting a new high here to talk all about it. John Jankowski from Las Vegas Coin Company. How are you, buddy? Good morning, everybody. Good, Good to morning. be here, as Wonderful. always. Wonderful. You wore a very cheery shirt for us. Well, thank, thank you. you. Yeah. It's kind of like, I don't know, yeah. kind of Vegas 50s kind of thing. We're totally kind of is. like matching today. It's a well, vibe. Well, we planned that. <laughs> 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 All right, let's talk about so, coins. Okay, the, the precious metals markets are at an all-time, or almost all-time high. Wow. And a lot of people have this stuff, but they aren't aware of their values. Hmm. So I brought, you know, stacks of these coins in before, hey, like the one hey. that just rolled onto the floor. But in reality, this one dime, we will pay $2 for that dime. So some of you Dang. have this many of them wow. laying around, you're yeah. sitting on a lot of money. Here's just a silver quarter from 1964. And so are the dimes, by the way, 64 and earlier. Please don't bring us regular dimes because I can't pay $2 for those. Right. But that quarter is it just the date. No, it, see, that's the part that's not important. Oh. As long as they're silver from 1964 and earlier. So I guess, oh. yes, the date. But okay. you don't have to okay. throw your coins. That quarter, that. That we'll pay cool. $5 for the quarter. We'll pay $10 for this half dollar. This stuff adds up to a lot of money. Yeah. And a lot of people don't realize how just a handful of this. In fact, here, as a, for instance, we have this. Mm -hmm. yeah, cool That's that we would pay $145 for that little handful of silver coins. Jeez. Whoa. I mean, there's so, plenty of people. I, I, I bet most people have them in a Ziploc baggie, too. Yes. But, mm -hmm. or, you know. or a Crown Royal bag. That's right. <laughs> That's right. The blue Crown Royal. They have them sitting around. And, you know, it's always like, I think, with precious metals, you're waiting for that right time to sell it, right? Well, the, you are, but it's hard to time a market exactly. Yeah. If you have this stuff laying in a desk drawer, this is probably a good time to get rid of it. Mm. Same with jewelry. We buy a lot of jewelry. Okay. Um, and again, people aren't aware of how this adds up. JJ, this ring, yeah. we bought this recently. We paid $455 for that ring. Wow. It's 14 carat. And just that one piece is worth a lot of money. And if you head over to... It's neat. It's like a little knot. Wow. Look at that, Jess. Yeah. It is kind of neat. Now, if I take this scrap jewelry... Pretty. Okay. If somebody's fortunate enough to want to get rid of and mm -hmm. have that much, mm -hmm. we paid $5,366 <gasps> for that jewelry. What's in my hand right now? $5,000. Whoa. Wow. And what carat gold is this? It's mainly 14, but there's some yeah. 18 in there as well. Yeah. And so we'll buy any carat gold. And speaking of oh. value in small packages, can Jessica. We, uh -huh. Can we show yeah, this Yeah, you saw which one I grabbed right away, I huh, did. John? I did, I <laughs> did. So tell us about this one right here. That's a diamond solitaire, and we bought that for $4,800. Oh, And so word. again, uh, value can come in very small packages. Now, will oh, you yeah. sell that? Well, yes. I, I'm, I'm impressed, actually, that you told us how much you bought it for, because now I'm going to know what you're going to make out <laughs> I, I would sell I, it to you for $4,801. Uh, <laughs> just because that's the friend discount. Yes. Yeah. No, but I, I appreciate your transparency. Um, so you buy, you sell, and you have a lot going on in your jewelry counter, more than even last year. Oh, yeah, far more. We expanded. We doubled our jewelry counter for retail sales, but we're also buying mm. a lot more jewelry. Mm. We have a good reputation, yeah. and we'd like to keep it. Take your Coke bottle back. Yeah. I know. I we're on this Coke. one. I love we're this Coke <laughs> bottle. I know you do. What else do we have here? That's a gold set from Canada. There's a stack of $2 yeah. bills just for interest. There's an interesting Ooh. Darth Vader watch in the original Ooh. package. That's, Ooh. Star Wars fans. That's from when it first came out. No kidding. Oh, yeah. Really? That's, yes. We have someone in the building that would that's love to really, see that. I know. That's, that's a rare thing. Yeah. <laughs> and then cool. that Indiana Jones uh, action figure, that's yeah. a graded figure. And of course, the new movie's just coming out yeah. momentarily. And, <laughs> and Mickey, who doesn't love Mickey? <laughs> did you know we had Mickey Mouse in studio last we week? We did. I did not. We did. I thought that's why you brought him. <laughs> yes, I did. I'm sorry. I misspoke. Uh huh. <laughs> I'm learning well, from you guys. Uh, you listen. guys recover really quick. John, we love when every time you bring these pieces, especially when they look like this. 
<laughs> Listen, to learn more about selling or buying your unique pieces, be sure to visit LasVegasCoinCompany.com. You can also follow them on Facebook and Twitter or head down to their location on Eastern Avenue. And if you still are into person-to-person -person interaction and would like to have a conversation with my friend John, he's located on Southeastern on the west side of the street, right on the border of Las Vegas and Henderson. Las Vegas Coin Company.